Hi, I'm Cass Slater and I work for Salford Hall NHS Foundation Trust, which is part of the Northern Care Alliance. Um, I'm giving my time today because I think it's really important that we encourage young people to still enter into the NHS and the variety of careers that you can do. And it's really important that we keep our NHS going. Um, my job title is a specialist speech and language therapist and I've worked for Salford for 22 years now. So my entire career has been here. Um, I've kind of always been involved with NHS work. My mum was a stroke nurse and ran a stroke unit. So as a teenager, uh, even as a child, I spent a lot of my time in hospital. As a teenager, I worked as an auxiliary nurse um, throughout university. It was a career that I was sort of exploring, um, did some observation and just really enjoyed it. So, that's, um, so I always thought I would work with adults, but actually when I got into the world of work, um, children was where I'm at. So um, my current role is I spend a couple of days carrying out initial assessments. So children who are coming for the, for the first time to assess their communication skills and provide advice and support to parents um, and help develop their treatment plans. Um, I also work in schools, so I quite, quite often get to see a lot of those children come through the, the pathways from sort of like through that, throughout their school career and can help and advise. Um, Work with a variety of children. I also specialise in stammering um, and I'm the student coordinator. So if you get a placement in Salford, I will um, be part of arranging your placements and making sure that you get a, a, a hopefully a really good experience and maybe want to come work for us in the future as well. Um, what skills have I developed over the years? I would say I'm very flexible and adaptable. There's lots of changes going on in the NHS all the time. Um, and obviously children change, so you need to be flexible, adaptable, be able to think on your feet. Um, being able to sort of empathise with the families that you're with, because we work with a lot of um, children and families from various backgrounds. Um, we, we work with a lot of um, children with social, emotional and mental health needs. And we have a lot of bilingual families as well. We have a lot of refugees in Salford. Um, so just being able to adapt to the, to the various caseloads. Um, what advice would I give myself as a younger person? Um, just be brave, just do it. Um, we don't always have the answers, um, but yeah, just give it a go. Um, and one key trait for me, it's been humour. You need to keep your sense of humour. Um, I will find the funny side in any situation, which can, you know, lighten the load a little bit sometimes.